Hello everybody, my name is Kai1. Today I'm going to share with you guys this Manfrotto 577 series quick release adapter from Skier. Also, I'm going to compare this new Skier adapter with my old, this is the U and Quick Shoe Jumbo from Japan, this small adapter. I own a 502 Fluid Head, so I already have a Manfrotto quick release plate. But the official Manfrotto 577 adapter is so expensive. So I went to the camera shop to check out the skier version and the Manfrotto version. They are pretty much identical. The only difference will be the quick release plate. This is the official quick release plate. It's thick, it's heavy, just built like a rock. And this is the skier quick release plate come with this skier quick release adapter. This release plate is thinner, it's lighter, but there are a few downsides. First, the edge of this quick release plate are pretty sharp. You might hurt your hands while you are hand holding the camera like this. This is really not a good design. In the other hand, the Manfrotto quick release plate is pretty smooth, round edge, and also have a better anti-slip texture on this official quick release plate. Second, if you are going to release this skier plate, after one full circle, this plate will come out like a roller coaster. <laughs> In the other hand, the official Manfrotto plate won't come out like a roller coaster. After one full circle, you will just stuck in place and you still can take it out easily but it won't fly out like a roller coaster. So the thickness of the quick release plate does matter. After sharing this 577 quick release adapter, if you are going to shoot video, why you need a 577 series adapter instead of something cheaper like this? This quick shoot jumbo quick release adapter, I have already owned it over three years. This quick release plate is pretty intuitive. Sliding, lock, done. In the other hand, this 577 series, you need to slide in, change your position and lock into place. This quick shoe jumbo adapter works pretty well with the stabilizer because you just slide your camera in place and you're ready to go. You don't need to adjust back and forth. Yeah, so this quick release adapter sounds pretty good. But these few years, my camera getting bigger and bigger, lens getting bigger and bigger. So it started wiggle. Another problem, the tape between the anti-slip pad and this quick release plate just slide all over the place. So if you're going to shoot in some kind of hot condition or your camera is pretty hot, this glue will just melt and the pad just slide all over the place. Another problem, after three years, the mechanism not so smooth anymore. Sometimes it will just stuck in the middle or just can even slide in. So this U and Quick Shoe Jumbo is time to retire. And this 577 Quick Release adapter is just an update. It doesn't mean I don't like this small adapter. If you are going to use a small camera, this is a good choice. On the other hand, bigger camera, you should buy a 577 Quick Release adapter. After you lock it up, nothing will move. No any moving part. Nothing will wiggle like the Quick Shoe Jumbo. Okay, so if you like this review and comparison video, press like, make sure you subscribe my YouTube channel to check out more crazy video. And if you want to watch more video like this, check out this playlist. Okay, and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.